Hello, this is Chris from Paletech, and this video we are going to learn how to add a button to our website. To do that, we need to go to the top and then click on Edit Site. Then we are going to go to the left to the Add button, we are going to click, and then we are going to go to Buttons, and we are going to add one of the theme buttons. This one right here, we are going to click with the left mouse button. Hold right and then we are going to release on our side. So now we can go and change a few things. So we are going to click on design and then we are going to click on customize design. And now we have a few options on the hover and the regular. We can change them mostly in the same manner. And if we click here, we can select to apply the changes we are making on the regular to the hover. So we are going to start with the background fields and now we can change the color of the button and add a few layers to it as well if we want of different colors and move them, move them as we need. So we are going to move to the text and here we can select the show of or hide the text, select the type of text is going to be a paragraph and heading and so on. We are going to leave that on our paragraph 3. We can change the type of font, the size of the font, add some effects to the font. And here we can change the text color, select, for example, this one, it's really good. We can select an outline for our, for the text of our button. And we can select a highlight color like this, if we want to. And we can change the text direction and select the alignment, the space between the characters and the line spacing, it could be custom or automatic, and we can add some shadow as well. We can add a border, in this case it already has one, we can make it a little bit bigger. Change the color and select the type of border we want it to be. Then on corners, we can give it a more round edge, like this. We can add shadows to our button and on the layer we can select to choose what to show the text icon only and text and icon, the icon and text position. We can change it in any way we want. The alignment or we can select a custom one if we want the space between the text and the icon we can choose it right here add some padding and for the icon we can select show or hide the icon select the size the color and we can give it an inclination if we want to our button to our icon right here so we are going to close this one and we are going to go to change text and icon and here we can select to show text icon text or nothing what the button says in this case we go to the blog we can choose to change the icon we can Add a file from the library, or we could select media from Wix, and we have some basic shapes, and we can select, for example, some arrows, and choose one for our icon, for example, an arrow to the right. Choose, and this is the one we are go it's going to show, and now we can add a link. To our button, it could be a page of the site, an address, an anchor, top button of page, document, email, phone number, like box. In this case, we are going to use 
one of the pages, the blog page, and select to open on the current window. So we are going to click on run. And now we have our style, we have the link for our button, and we can give it an animation to make it a little bit more cool. We can select a review, for example. Look nice. I will do the and slide in. And here we can customize the animation, the direction from where it will show the type of power you have, the duration, the delay, and only animate the first time. So that's it, we have learned how to add a button to our Wix site in a quick and easy manner. If you like the video, subscribe to our channel and share with a friend who might have on the sites. See you the next time on Politech.